Hey, what is going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to Cyber Realms today on SAO Alicization Lic Lycris. Lycris, I still don't know which one is which. I'm going to show you guys how to get your very first accessory. Now, I have progressed the game a little bit and I am currently now heading, supposed to head to Centoria, but or Zakara, but basically what they'll introduce to you at this point is something called a side quest or request at this point. So what you want to do is kind of make your way through the village. You could accept these quests, which I choose not to. I've already taken a look at them, but I found out that there was a quest that is much more rewarding, or at least it will yield you the very first uh, accessory that you want to get in the game. So you want to talk to this guy at the back end of the village. His name is Dapa, and you just simply want to talk to him by pressing whichever key to interact. I'm going to go ahead and skip this. And now what he'll do is you must find a... What they'll tell you is that there is a mysterious note containing a treasure uh, that you must... Uh, it's basically a riddle. So the item will description will give you is this. I sleep before the eastern stone beyond the river. Now, on under most circumstances, you might get confused with one of the stones that actually gets displayed later on here, but that's not the case. We're actually going to head somewhere here. And uh, just be aware, there is a high-level boss, I guess, field boss at that area, so you just want to kind of minimize the casualties or the potential uh, dangers by trying to avoid that boss as best as you can. In this area, generally you'll find yourself around level 4 monsters. They're okay if you want to train a little bit just to get the hang of the controls, but I'm going to pass by them really quickly and move along here. There's also a level 6, level 4, level 5 mobs where I'm going to ignore them. I'm actually level 10 now if I remember correctly. Yeah, I'm level 10 now, so there's really no need for me to. And uh, this hill is going to be uh, a bitch. Alright, we made our way here. So, upon this rock, you'll find the treasure. So, it does display itself. Once you examine the rock, it will tell you that you must now report back to Dopa. Uh, the enemy that I'm saying to be cautious of is by heading in this direction, you'll find yourself face to face against a level 12 Queen Bee. Uh, despite the, their level being pretty close to me, I still find myself having trouble trying to fight it. I just actually died uh, prior to making this video to this boss. Uh, kind of sad, to be honest, <laughs> but what can you do, right? Levels aren't everything in this game. And now, back in Rulid's, vid uh, uh, Rulid's Village, you want to head back to Dopa and just simply speak with him. And then when this dialogue is finished, you will receive a crystalline ring, which gives you 11 defense. It's uh, it also gives you a secret art damage of 24 silent flash, but um, the, the whole idea is that this ring is the very first accessory, or one of the very few first accessories that you can obtain. So I think this is quite worth it. Uh, and if anyone was confused on where to find this, uh, you now know the location. So I'm going to go ahead and display the world map once again. The location is directly to the bottom right corner. This is the area that you would find it. So, all right. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully, that helped some of you to clear this quest if you were confused as to where to go. And uh, I have more guides on the video uh, on the game coming up very soon. So, hopefully, you guys would stay tuned. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.